Good morning, class. Welcome to today's math lesson. My name is Mrs. Lawson, and I am so glad that you're here to play with math with me today. Today, we are going to be playing with our geo boards. If you have one, I would love for you to get out your geo board and some rubber bands so that we can play and play with shapes and designs. I have just made two shapes on this geo board. I was using this card as a little pattern. I have made two triangles right beside each other, but I want you to look at it very, very closely. How many triangles do you see in this design? There's one triangle here. I used a yellow rubber band. And there's another triangle here. I used a green rubber band. These two triangles are the same shape and the same size. That means they're congruent. Hmm, are they the same shape and the same size as the triangles on the paper? They're not, are they? They're the same shape, but they're not the same size. What do we call shapes that are the same shape but not the same size? We call them similar. They're similar shapes. Well, there's two triangles here. One, two, but maybe if you squint, you can see one really big triangle. So there's one, two, and then another big one. So it's like there are three triangles. Well, let's take a look at another little card like this and see if we can make this design. Hmm. Let's look at it really, really closely. How many triangles do you see? Hmm. I see a giant triangle here, and I'm going to try to make it on this board. I'm going to move this one over. All right, I think I'll use this fun blue one. I'm going to put this right here so that I can see it. And if you have a board at home, I would like for you to make this triangle. It is very tall. It goes all the way up to the top and it goes all the way along the bottom. So that's one triangle. And then I see a smaller triangle over here. So I am going to make that one as well. I think I'll make it with a yellow one. So this is one, two, three of the little spokes that stick out. One, two, three. And then I am going to make another triangle over here right beside it. And this triangle is going to be congruent to the other yellow triangle. It's going to be the same shape and the same size. So the two yellow triangles are the same shape and the same size, so they're congruent. And the blue one is the same shape, but it's not the same size, so it's not congruent. It is just similar. And I have completed this design here. Is it congruent? Mm, no, it's not, because it's not the same size. This one is much smaller, but it is similar. Now, I want you to see a little bit of a math trick. We made three triangles, a blue one, a yellow one, and another yellow one. But do you see that there's actually more triangles than that on our board? There's one, two, three, but oh, what about this little one here? That's four, and this one over here, five. And look, this one here, six. I see six triangles. How many can you see? I think it is fun to play with our geo boards and try to copy designs. I think that I'm going to make another one. I'll switch these out. I'm going to take these off. And when I take mine off, I do it really carefully so that it doesn't kind of fling back and hit me. This time, I'm going to make this design. There's how many squares? I'm going to make two squares, but I think that we'll end up seeing more than that. I will use this blue one here. This goes one, two, three, four spokes. One, two, three, four spokes. And it goes up four. 
and over four. So it's a true square. It is one, two, three squares by one, two, three squares. So we've made one square and I'm going to do another one over here. I think I'll use a nice pink elastic for that one. It just goes over three spokes or two kind of square areas. There we go, I made a blue square and a pink square. Hmm. That was two squares. Do you see another square on my geo board? Well, there's lots of squares, but made with the rubber bands. There's one, two, and look at this little one right here. It became an overlapping design. Just like these two little triangles were, became part of the overlapping design, as well as the triangle in the middle became part of the overlapping design. Oh class, these are fun. It's like they're little shape riddles. Do you know what? If you have time today, I would like for you to make your own overlapping design and then See if you can make one and maybe one of your friends or family members could make one too. Oh class, I hope you have a wonderful time. Bye-bye.